I have tested all the tubes in the RCA meter and all three of them are good which is very good news and the transformer appears to be good I put uh, just a little bit of voltage on it on the variac and I could see the um, the pilot light uh, light up a little bit and that's all I did to it just shut it down so I decided well it's uh, time to start replacing the capacitors and looking at this range switch notice that the uh, high voltage is 1500 volts well that's why this capacitor has a working voltage of 1600 volts the problem is I don't have a dot one microfarad capacitor at 1600 working volts okay so what I'm going to try and do is uh, make one of these from some capacitors that I already have this is a dot one 1600 working volts and I have a number of capacitors um, to work with so I'm going to make uh, different combinations and see if I can't come up with dot one at at least 1600 working volts and I'm going to use my meter here at here's the capacitance dot two one five okay dot two two seven or uh, 2.27 okay let's put these in series okay dot one nine but that's still not up to 1600 working volts that's a little bit less that would be 1260 volts okay Got another one of these. Get a alligator clip. Clip these two together. Okay, that looks like that's going to work. So we're well over 1600 working volts now at dot one microfarads. I am representing that two dot two microfarad capacitor at 600 volts like this and that 630 working volts that is the gap between the plates and the size of the plate is represented by the 2.2 microfarads but that gap what that means is you have to get above 630 working volts or 630 volts before electrons will jump across that gap or short out now I'm adding more than one capacitor in series here now I've got a 
2.2 and the 0 0.22 microfarad capacitors and they're both 630 working volts. Well all you do is add up the gaps and this combination is now 1260 working volts but the capacitance is less. Well it still wasn't low enough yet and also the working voltage wasn't high enough so I added another dot two two microfarad capacitor at six hundred and thirty working volts. Now we have the right capacitance as we saw in the video but the working volts is now one thousand eight hundred and ninety working volts. Here is the formula for figuring out the capacitance of those three capacitors in series and if I would have four or more let's say I had four well there'd be another plus one over C4 added to that and you just do that for each capacitor you have in series but we only have three and here are the values we've got the 2.2 and the dot 2.2 and then the other dot 2.2 and that works out to be dot 4.5 plus 4.54 plus 4.54 and that is equal to 1 over 9.53 and the capacitance works out to be 0. 1049 microfarads. Clip these two together. Okay, that looks like that's going to work. So we're well over 1600 working volts now at dot one microfarads.